That is the sound of an egg beater harvesting cranberries. That agitation of the water will knock those berries that sit on the vines and it will knock them off and it will allow the, water, the, the fruit to come up to the top of the water. You may not think about how the cranberries make it to your Thanksgiving table, but growers produce 80 million pounds of cranberries during Thanksgiving week alone. The air pockets cause the roughly 10 million cranberries in this five acre field to be harvested through flooding bogs. Uh, the vines are very hardy, so you've seen these beaters running over the tops of the plants. You know, if you were to do that to a blueberry bush or anything else, you'd be breaking the branches. These things are very flexible. We came in and we, we flooded our bog this morning. The pickers work together to corral the berries. We turn them into a big circle. Um, we'll pull them into a pump truck, and that pump truck will pump them into our tractor trailer. The cranberries are sorted and washed using a machine then are sent to market. All of these berries will become processed products, juices, craisins, dried cranberries, and, and sauce, and things like that. It takes one full day to pick and pack all of the berries in this bog. Once sent to storage, people have the option to buy them fresh or frozen. Reporting for WEBN in Foxborough, I'm Samantha Avalos.